Okay, next question. What is LADA? Latent autoimmune diabetes. Okay. LADA is latent autoimmune diabetes of adulthood. I get phone calls out of the blue from strangers. I have LADA. What should I do about it? I have LADA. Should I come and see you? Um, uh, it's uh, it's a, a matter of interpretation. For example, uh, one patient I've had for many years uh, was 40 years old and developed type 1 diabetes. So you could call that LADA, latent autoimmune, latent was, it was late, uh, autoimmune diabetes of adulthood. Uh, so it's like getting type 1 diabetes when you're an adult. Now I've heard some people say that LADA is a very extreme, and I've read about this too, but the cases are so rare where they have very high unstable blood sugars and since I didn't treat them, I don't know how unstable they are. Uh, so I can't, uh, you know, the finger has been pointed at diabetics since I was a kid that uh, uh, this person is very labile. And usually it's the treatment that's labile, the treatment that makes their blood sugars uh, up and down on roller coasters. So, um, uh, there's this group supposedly of adult diabetics who have very hard control, hard to control roller coaster blood sugars. And to be honest, I have not seen one of those. Brittle, you mean? Very brittle. It, cause, and it could well be that the doctors are, are calling this brittle merely because they're dealing again with type 1 diabetes where they call everyone brittle and blame it on the patient. Uh, where, so they don't have to be uh, smart about treatment. And uh, I've seen thousands of diabetic patients. I've not seen one type 1 patient, no matter what the age of onset, that was hard to control, except if they had an eating problem, and then we usually are able to handle the eating problem, but with a lot of effort. We have all kinds of tricks. Okay.